Hey guys, Leanne here on Grady's Mom. I have my grocery haul this week to share with you from Walmart. I did go to Target Friday. I'm filming this on a Sunday. So it's a little bit smaller of a haul than usual because I did pick up some other things Friday at Target, which you guys will see later in the week. So I did get some bread things. I got some Pepperidge Farm. Um, these are just regular old hot dog rolls because we're going to have hot dogs with like chili dogs this week. Um, if I have any rolls over, I use them for sandwiches. I got some of our white wheat bread that we eat every week. Also got these for my husband's lunch. They are the healthy multigrain pocket um, flatbreads. They're kind of like pita pockets, and I just make his sandwiches in there. Um, I got one of these buffalo chicken flatbread pizzas. Since today is football Sunday, I'm just going to make this as like one of our little appetizers. We do a lot of munchies on Sundays during football season for lunch. Got a big bag of kale. I'm going to do some of my Olive Garden Toscana soup this week. And it calls for a bunch of kale and then whatever's left I'll use in another recipe. I also got a bag of the tricolor coleslaw. It's just the cabbage, a little shredded red cabbage and carrot. These are such a kitchen hack for anybody using cabbage in a recipe. I highly recommend them. They're super cheap as well. I think this bag is like $1.40. I got a thing of our juice, the white cranberry strawberry some butter for mashed potatoes and a glazed carrots this week these are the half sticks which are really convenient got a birthday card for a friend don't want to show the card because that friend will most likely be watching some lunch meat for my husband's lunches this week i got three quarters a pound of butterball turkey and some sara lee rare roast beef uh, this is i think a pound some baby swiss cheese for my husband's sandwiches for work Got a couple Snapples for my husband's lunches to throw in, a kiwi strawberry, and a Snapple apple. This is my favorite Snapple flavor, personally. Um, if anybody's looking for something different, this is a really, really good one. I also got some Newman's Own pine or Mango Salsa. Usually I get the pineapple, but I decided to switch it up today and get mango also to munch on today with some chips for football. Got a couple of soups just to suck the pantry, a Manhattan clam chowder, and then an Italian wedding soup. These are for my cat. They're like meat stick things, almost like Slim Jims for cats. So I got these for her. Got another thing of panko breadcrumbs because I want to do a batch of breaded baked pork chops this week. Got my cat's food. Um, this is the broth pack things. They have like meat and broth in them for my cat. A dozen eggs. These I'm obsessed with. I don't get them very much because I forget about them, but they're just the combos, individual snack size bags. So they're nice for portion control. This is a variety pack. I got our favorite pizza sauce, which is the Classico Traditional. I'm going to make homemade pizza one night this week. I got the Peter Rabbit Organic Squeezable Pouches that Grady takes to school. They are the strawberry banana, and he absolutely loves these. I also got some of the organic Capri Sun Fruit Punch Packs. They're, they are the cheapest at Walmart, although they are expensive um, just because they're organic. So I got these at Walmart. Um, a gallon of water for the Keurig. Some of the original Tostitos for the chips. I got some of our favorite hot dogs. We don't eat hot dogs a whole lot, um, but we're going to grill some hot dogs this week. And again, make chili cheese dogs. So we like the beef Nathan's. And then I got two packs of the Butterball Italian style seasoned ground turkey. One of these will go in the freezer for next week and one of these will go with that cabbage dish that I've been talking you guys' ear off about on and off for like a month. So this is the haul. I will insert my total here and I will share my meal plan after this. Okay, so meal plan for the week starting today, which is Sunday the 25th of September, moving into Saturday, which is October 1st already. Can you guys believe that? All right, so one night next week, I'm going to do my Olive Garden Toscana soup, probably in the crock pot. I have all of the ingredients already at home for it. I just had to buy the kale, as you guys saw. I do have a video on this recipe, so I will link that down below. And then I'm going to do some garlic bread on the side. I actually have some frozen garlic bread that I can use up for that. Tonight, actually, we're having that turkey and cabbage dish with glazed carrots and mashed potatoes. I'm in the process, as we speak, of trying to get... A different style cooking video filmed today for this um, and you'll see what I mean by a different style that will be out probably next week we're also going to do homemade pizza um, homemade using the pizza dough that my mom brought my parents brought from New York I'm going to use one of those doughs and homemade pizza I'll just put cheese sauce and whatever toppings that I feel like at the time and I'll do a tossed salad on the side 
Another night, I'm going to do some panko breaded baked pork chops. I have some boneless pork chops to use up in my freezer. So I'm just going to bre bread them with some panko and egg and flour and bake them in the oven. And then I'm going to do some stovetop stuffing. I have a bunch of stovetop to use up from BJ's. We don't have it very much, but we're going to have it this week with the pork chops. And I'll pull out one of my mom's frozen green beans and steam those up as well. One night we're going to do breakfast for dinner, specifically some pumpkin spice pancakes, um, which you guys will see later in the week in a different haul from Target. I'm going to do some sausage patties that I got at Aldi, and then I'll do whatever fruit we have to use up at the time, whether that's banana or grapes or berries or something like that. One night we're going to do chili, cheese, hot dogs. I have some meat sauce in my deep freezer to use up. You guys saw the hot dogs and the hot dog rolls, and I also have some loaded baked potatoes that I made a huge double batch of last month, I believe, and froze some, so I have to thaw out those. We'll probably have two halves each, so equivalent to like one whole potato each, so I have to thaw those out, and then I'll make a salad just using whatever's ready in the garden um, and that kind of thing. And then I did a lot one night for leftovers um, because most likely we're going to have leftover Toscana soup because this makes a good amount. Um, and just, you know, kind of, a, kind of a freebie night. Leftovers, and if I don't have enough for leftovers, we'll eat whatever little things we have, and then I'll make dinner salads, um, whether that ends up being a Caesar salad or a chef salad or just some kind of random creative concoction that I come up with. So fairly easy meal plan for the week. Again, I will link down below the recipe, the video for the Toscana. Um, and what else do I have? And I also have a recipe which I've linked in several other videos for my loaded twice baked potatoes. I will link those down below as well. I hope you guys enjoyed the haul and the meal plan. Have a great day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. <music>